Mm-hmm. All right, what I have here is an Acer C910. Uh, it's actually the uh, C910C453 model. I have a broken screen. Uh, I'm going to show you how to fix it. Ordered uh, the screen from uh, laptopscreen.com. Uh, came here rather quickly. Um, the uh, it looks to be a, an exact um, replacement. So here's the the new screen here. So here we go. Um, this is actually uh, really simple with these models. Just uh, make sure you have it off. I am not going to take anything off the bottom. I'm just going to do everything on the top here. So um, you start off by uh, removing the, uh, the side of the screen and the bezel of the screen here. Just kind of moving your way up and around. Okay. And it should just pop right off. Um, now with that open, I have four screws, one, two, three, and four that I have to remove. So let's go ahead and do that. They're just uh, standard Phillip head screws. So now I just uh, carefully take the screen and just fold it down here. You'll see that um, the 30-pin uh, connector down here is uh, is a got some tape on it. So we just got to very gently remove that tape to remove it. The only tools I'm using for this is just the, uh, the screwdriver. I uh, normally would have a plastic tool when you do something like this, but I know this is a fairly simple process on the screen. So. so now I took that off, and to release it, it's just a simple snap of that. So now I got my old screen off. Uh, you can see that it's broken up there. Uh, the new one, just uh, do the same thing. I'll place it down here. I'll just fold it back. Uh, make sure you got a firm, firm grip on it. You're going to have to make sure it seats in there well. You'll hear a click. And then uh, just kind of push the tape back down to, to where it was. Um, you'll see that the cord down here, um, you're going to want to weed, uh, weave that back into where it came out of. Just like so. Oops. So just like so. That's what my, uh, this other screwdriver is here for. Help me with that process. So you're not pinching that cable, it just has to go um, on the bottom there and these go there. Okay. So there's one screw. Two. And we'll go to the other one on the top here. That's number three. And number four. So that's on. Uh, before I uh, place the bezel on it, I'm just going to go ahead and press the power to see if it starts up. And it looks like it's functioning like it should. All right. So go ahead and just power it down. Here, um, I will remove the protective covering now. Uh, I chose a matte screen with this just because 
the unit came with a matte screen, so we should be good there. By the way, it kind of looks looks like the specs. You just press this back into place. Looks like it's all right. Yeah, we have a fixed screen. Thanks for watching.